Many parents would agree that when they send their children to daycare, they expect their kids to be safe and well taken care of. But an Athens mother says she removed her two year old from a local daycare center after the child came home with injuries. News 19's Kayla Smith is on the story, joins us in the studio with more. Well, this mom is speaking out after she says her two year old received unfair treatment, not only suffering injuries, but also being blamed for them. Video from the daycare proves otherwise. This mother wants to keep her identity a secret out of fear of retaliation, but still wants to share her story because she's concerned about the well being of other children. So you really do have to put your faith into that center. Um, and trust that they're in the best hands that you can possibly put them in. An Athens mother says her trust in her child's daycare has been broken. Within the last month, she noticed a bite mark on her two-year-old's arm and a bruise on the face. When she reached out to her child's daycare, she was told the injuries were self-inflicted. But the mother says this explanation didn't make sense to her. I immediately said, you know, I don't believe that. That's not how my kid... Um, handles being upset. They normally just throw themselves on the floor and cry. When the mother reached out to the daycare, the child care worker admitted she had lied about the bite mark. It had actually been caused by another student. And the director of the daycare said she would check the security camera footage from the day of the incident. The director calls me to tell me, hey, we need you to come back in. We have more footage that we want you to see. And it was the video of my child being struck. You see the child enter the room first at Kids Journey Child Development Center in Athens, closely followed by child care worker Tamika Baker. In the video, Baker appears to hit the child in the face with a shoe. That's really not fair to, to do that at all. According to the mother, Baker is no longer employed by Kids Journey Child Development Center, but she says she believes this was not a one-time incident at the center and wants other parents to be aware. Hopefully. It hasn't happened to anybody else, but I, I find it hard to believe, you know. You can't tell me that the same day, the same class, two teachers hitting two different children, that it, they're not comfortable enough to have been doing that. A representative of Kids Journey Child Development Center says the instructor, Tamika Baker, has been terminated. She says the center is cooperating with the Limestone County Department of Human Resources and local law enforcement. I also spoke with the Athens Police Department. An officer there told me there is a warrant out for Tamika Baker's arrest. He says he expects her to turn herself into police.